Today, in this video, we're going to we're going to be looking at some of the uh, figures review of the New York Toy Fair. I think it's the New York Toy Fair, right? I wish I could have gone because I'm in New York right now. But anyways, this is Warlord. Um, again, I'm like 15 years old. Don't really know who Warlord is, but uh, yeah. So like, I, I just wanted to get this out of the way. But um, yeah, we're going to be looking at an, a new Elite ring as well. Like, oh my gosh, it just looks so great. Let's just get right into it. Oh my God. Now, please, can someone tell me what this Rhino is supposed to be? Can someone tell me what this rhino is? Like, bro, what is this figure? Like, it's just off. The arms are off. The hair is off. Like, the actual face. I mean, it's not good, but it's not bad either, right? But the hair is off. The, the arms are off. The shoulders. Like, everything about it, almost everything about it is just off. Like, for me... I got if I got the opportunity to get this, this would definitely be a pass for me. All right, a straight up pass. But I mean, he comes up with a he comes with the SmackDown tag titles, so I, it would kind of suck if he only came with one. Like, come on, I would definitely just buy the tag titles separately off of eBay for like five bucks or something like that because the Rhino. Definitely, definitely not worth getting, in my opinion. Just looks horrible. First ever WWE Mattel. I think it's our first ever, right? Shane McMahon figure. What do I think of this figure? Um, everyone's like, oh my god, oh my god, Shane McMahon figure. Shane McMahon, yeah, 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 yeah. Honestly, I think that it's good. I mean, it's okay, but everyone's just making such. Uh, I don't know. I, I feel like it's definitely gonna be an overrated figure. I think most people. Um, want it in the moment because it's a Shane McMahon figure. Definitely, I get the opportunity to get it. I am going to get it because, um, I want a Shane McMahon figure in my collection. But I don't think it's, like, that, that good. Like, I mean, the face scan, it, it's okay. The, the attire, I feel like it could have been done a little bit better. I don't know. I just, like... I don't know, I just feel like it could have been done a little bit better. But it looks good, though. It looks good. I definitely would buy it. I definitely would buy it. So, uh, yeah, that's the Shane McMahon figure. It looks awesome. Believe, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. I know that you will. John Cena. Now, it, it, it honestly is... It, there's not that much to it. It's like every pa past, like, five John Cena figure. It's just like all the past five John Cena at least that we've got. And what you see is what you get. Red, white, and blue. Um, It's not even his current attire, which sucks. Honestly, I would have liked it if they would have just skipped this and went with his, with his attire that he has on now. Oh my god, Makai. But, um, they didn't know because it, it took a few months to process. Honestly, the junk, like, like, don't they usually get, like, a heads up about things, though? Like, attires and stuff, but I don't, I don't know. I, I feel like it, it, eh. it, it, it I'm, I'm gonna get it because I always get the... I, I've gotten every John Cena Elite in every color that he has on, but still, I, I, it's just a John Cena figure, not that big of a deal. But it's it looks good though, it looks good. All right, guys, I don't even know what Elite series this is in. Sorry, but um, yeah, this is the new Elite Stephanie McMahon figure that's coming out. I don't like it. I I really don't like like it's not bad. Like I don't know. Like okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna say I don't like it. I I like it. it it's good, right? But I, I wouldn't buy it honestly. I, I don't like it enough to get it. Like, I, I already have a Stephanie McMahon figure in my collection. Not that I'm one of those people. I have, like, tons of, um, like, the same figure. But it's just, like, I feel like I don't have the need for this in my collection whatsoever. I, I don't know why. I just feel like I have literally no need for this figure in my collection. Oh, what is first ever elite figure? Baron Corbin, what is first ever elite figure? What do I think of this figure? I honestly think that it's really good. Obviously, they use the same head scan that was on the basic, I believe, right? On the same face scan and the same hair mold, I believe. But honestly, I think that it's really good. I think I think that it looks really good. I like the jacket. Um, we didn't get like a whole lot of pictures of the, of the figure, but um, from what I'm seeing right now, it looks pretty good. I like the tattoo. The tattoos have a nice color on it. And yeah, I think I would definitely get this. It looks really good. Guys, this is Goldberg's first Mattel figure, right? Um, what do I think of this figure? Honestly, I think. I, I think that it looks pretty good. Honestly, I wish that it had a bit more chest hair. That's, like, my only thing. I wish that it had a little bit more chest hair, right? But, um, yeah, I think that it looks pretty cool. The head scan is really spot on. Usually, they can't, they, they really can't capture the essence of, like, how, I don't, I don't know, the, the WWE Superstar looks. Usually, when they have, like, a bald head, like, mostly, like, with the Ryback figures, I found that problem. But, like, Goldberg, it looks pretty spot on. 
There's a new elite ring. Honestly, this looks like really cool. Hopefully, like it's not just a completely different ring for SmackDown because I'm gonna be so mad. Like if if it's that way, I really like definitely don't want it. I really definitely don't want it. But like if it's just like interchangeable pieces, you know, like like the electronic parts. Like okay, you could change this part to Raw and then this part to SmackDown. I'll be fine with it. You know, you could change like the ring post Raw, ring post SmackDown. But if it's just like you gotta buy a completely different ring for Raw and a completely different ring for SmackDown, Smackdown. That's just that's just mental. That that's just wacky. But I mean, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. The the I see that the uh at least the actual mat is still cloth. It looks a bit smaller, so it's a bit more in scale with how it actually is on TV. And I think that it looks really good. I think that it looks really good. I definitely want that. It looks really good. But yeah, guys, don't forget to thumbs up this video. Leave a comment below and tell me what you guys think of this of these new figures that they revealed and all this new stuff. And yeah, guys, till tomorrow, guys, no two dudes every time. Sorry, every actually, not tomorrow because I'm live streaming tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern time. So yeah, guys, tune in for that and stay beastly.